Hello, everyone. Today' topic is manager skills of managers, level of managers. Lecture three. We will talk about who is manager, manager's role, skills of manager, levels of manager. Who is manager? A person responsible for controlling or administering an organization or group of staff. A person regarded in terms of their skill in managing resources, especially those of a household. A person responsible for supervising and motivating employees, and for directing the progress of an organization. Manager, a person who manages, one who manages a business institution. One who manages affairs or expenditures as of a household, a client, as an entertainer or athlete, an athletic team. The person in overall charge of a team and its strategy during games, practices, it is. In a school or college, a student in charge of the equipment and records of a team under the supervision of a coach. Manager's role. Managers are responsible for setting and achieving the firm's goals within twelve other people. Henry Mintzberg considered the manager's role. Henry Mintzberg is a management expert, author, and academic. He has written various books on management and now holds the Clickhorn Professorship of Management Studies. There have been a number of studies on what managers actually do. The most famous of which conducted by Professor Henry Mintzberg in the early 1970s. There are three managers' role: informational, interpersonal, decisional. A monitor, dismantler, spoke persons are. The informational role. Figurehead, leader, relation are the interpersonal role. The entrepreneurial, disturbance handler, resources allocator, and negotiator are the decisional role. Okay, first, informational role. Monitor. Managers regularly seek out information related to the organization. And industry looking for relevant changes in the environment. They also monitor the team in terms of both their productivity and their well-being. Disseminator, managers communicate potentially useful information to the colleagues and the team. Spokesperson. Managers represent and speak for their organization. They are responsible for transmitting information about their organization and its goals to the people outside it. A second, interpersonal role. Figurehead. Managers have social, ceremonial, and legal responsibilities. They are a source of inspiration. People look up to them as a person with authority and as a figurehead. Leader, manager provides leadership for the team, organization, and manages the performance and responsibilities of everyone in the group. Lesson, managers communicate with internal and external contacts. Third. Decisional role, entrepreneur, manager creates and controls change within the organization. This means solving problems, generating new ideas, and implementing them. Disturbance handler, when an organization or team hits an unexpected roadblock, it's the manager who must charge. Resources allocator. Manager need to determine where organizational resources are best applied. 
this involves allocating funding as well as assigning staff and other organizational resources. Negotiator Managers take part in and direct important negotiations within the same department or organization. Managerial skills Managerial skills are the knowledge and the ability of the individuals in a managerial position to fulfill some specific management activities or tasks. Managers will need skills that will help them to manage people and technology to ensure an effective and efficient realization of their working duties. After that, this knowledge and ability can be learned and practiced. Manager can develop each skill through learning and practical experience as a manager. Robert L. Katz Robert Katz is an American social and organizational psychologist. He created the concept of managerial skills, which describes how the required skill structure changes depending on the management level. He was born in 1933. What are managerial skills according to Katz? Social psychologist Robert Katz has set three areas of managerial skills and determination for which level they are characterized. Technical skills, human skills, and conceptual skills. Okay, first, conceptual skills. Ability of an individual to analyze complex situations and to rationally process and interpret available information. Ability to think creatively and understand abstract ideas. Conceptual skills, present knowledge or ability of a manager for more abstract thinking. That means he can easily see the whole truth analysis and diagnosis of different states. In such a way, they can predict the future of the business or department as a whole. After that, human skills. Interpersonal skills are the skills required to effectively communicate, interact, and work with individuals and groups. The human skills is the skills that present the manager's ability to interact, work or relate effectively with people. These skills enable the managers to make use of human potential in the company and motivate the employees for better results. Third, technical skills. Technical skills involve skills that give the managers the ability and the knowledge to use a variety of techniques to achieve their objectives. Technical skills that will be required to increase sales design different types of products and service, market the products and service. Technical skills are the knowledge and abilities needed to accomplish mathematical, engineering, scientific or computer-related duties, as well as other specific tasks. Managerial Level these managers are classified in the hierarchy of authority and perform different tasks. In many organizations, the number of managers in level every level resembles a pyramid. Top level managers are responsible for controlling and overseeing the entire organization. Middle-level managers are responsible for executing organizational plans which comply with the company's policies. 
These managers act as the intermediary between top-level management and low-level management. Low-level managers focus on controlling and directing. They serve as role models for the employees they supervise. Thanks for your attention. Hello everyone.